Definitely our work has changed, you know, slightly. We've just coming out of the collective redundancies, um, you know, discussions that we have for the last three to four years. We're doing more a little bit of creative work. Um, so we're doing, uh, you know, assistance to M&A transactions in a much more detail as we did a few years ago. We're doing a lot of work on employee investigations. Um, we're doing work on cross-border transfers. Um, and also we're just um, helping, advising um, Spanish companies doing their international work abroad, which is something that we didn't do to that level of extent in the past. Well, I mean, for clients in the first place, the, the, the challenge is uh, the, uh, the, the, the planning purpose that they need to do. Um, now we have the 2012 reform, um, which, you know, it's taken three to four years until the decisions of the judges have clarified a little bit the extent of the reform. But now we're just getting into a new political debate for the new elections and we don't know what is going to happen for the future. So the problem that the companies are facing now is, you know, when to do the, 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 the future prospects uh, uh, of the decision they have to, or the decisions they have to make, right? Um, for, for law firms, uh, the, the, the biggest challenge is how to deal with the uncertainty of the courts. And that's a very difficult challenge to deal with. But on the other hand, uh, and that's my personal opinion of the reform, is that it's just becoming, uh, the world has become much more sophisticated. So the way you need to advise clients on their collective redundancies issues, as an example, it's just becoming uh, more sophisticated, more difficult, um, and more professional. So that's, that's good for lawyers because you can really provide an added value to the company in order to you know, implement the plan that they are thinking of just uh, doing. That, that, that depends on the strategy that each law firm is, is taking to the approach of how to become efficient and how to do good work and added value work to clients. Uh, again, my, my perspective is that uh, now clients are just looking forward to receiving high level advice and that means that it has to be a partner level or a very senior associate level. Uh, that's, that's my opinion, right? And uh, so you need to create a, a much more, uh, again, sophisticated approach to the way you deal with the legal um, issues and the employment aspects because of the complexity and the level of uncertainty. And you need to partner with them that much. It's not just simply to implement things. Two plus two is not always four. It might be three, it might be four, it might be five. So you need more kind of tailor-made advice. And I think, uh, you know, we need to partner with them and, and, and clients are looking forward to receiving high-level advice, which requires experience. And um, so that's my opinion.